Hey, and welcome to another video of the Road to Opiate Krieg. Oh, that is a perfect timing. We, um, well, we started off the new playthrough at level 65 in the last episode. With our all legit farmed gear on this Krieg. And we're gonna continue on the hunt. Now, we did get some few a few tubbies last episode. Oh, that's a lot of rabbit skags. Really nice XP. Lovely. And they're dead. And yeah, in this episode we're just gonna continue farming a bit of XP. And um, we'll see what happens next. Oh, that's the drunk effect. Very nice. And in this episode, we might just take on the Clan Wars uh, mission. Oh, come on. Ah. Now, unfortunately, we don't have Boar on this character, so we gotta get used to that. But we do have quite a lot of damage. As you can see. Where did he go? There. Because I do want to get the slagger as a new slag weapon soon. It's pretty good. Now we could, of course, use our uh, level 50 Pimpernel that we farmed on our Zero character. But I feel like we need a bit more fire rate to get some quick bloodless stacks. Oh. So let's start that at level 68, why not? <clears throat> Connection lost. Doesn't matter. We're not playing online. Oh, that might actually be a problem because I'm uploading uh, the first episode of this playthrough at the moment. Yeah, let's quickly see if that's... Uh, Experiencing issues right now. Hmm. Doesn't look like it. So we're fine. No, I thought the uh, blood explosion would continue chaining there. What is that? Oh, rabbit. It was. So I do have a plan. We need to reach level 72, preferably 
get the Slagger at 72 as well. Um, we're gonna farm a Corrosive Sandhawk. And... A Corrosive Fastball. Yeah, so once we reach 72, we first should get the Fastballs in the correct elements. Wait, how did he not explode? The next thing is Bloodlust also improves your melee damage. So as you can see, we can finish them off by poking them with the rapier. Exploded simultaneously. Now you actually don't want that. You want the oh, that was the uh, drunk effect on the herald. You actually want to have one guy explode, then explode to the second guy with even more overkill, and then that should explode to another guy with even more overkill, and continuing like that. But if they're too closely together they will all instantly blow up with just one Nova and it won't stack on itself. Uh, and yeah, stacking on multiple chains is how you kill Pyro Pete very fast. Now you could kill basically any raid boss in that matter if there's lots of uh, minions nearby. But like for example Hyperius, there's not enough minions nearby so that won't work. Uh, for Master Gi, the sandworms, it can be a lot, but if they explode in Blood Explosion, they will explode underneath the ground for some reason. So that won't damage Master Gi. Uh, and with Veracidus, you can spawn in some enemies after killing that, uh, the guy with the shield on his face. Terramorphus doesn't have enough tentacles, I think. So yeah, Blood Explosion is not uh, like ideal, but for Pyro Pete it's definitely very easy. Just open up the two valves, get the minions to spawn, gather them up but not too closely, and then have them chain together. With like the maximum overkill damage you can do. So get 100 stacks of bloodlust, get into second wind, do a really big melee hit with the rapier, get lots of explosive damage from it, have everything slagged, and they should blow up instantly. Like this dude. Why do I keep missing my... Fastball. Now honestly this is actually still pretty fast for XP, because we kill them pretty much instantly.
yeah, the grog nozzle is not ideal for slacking enemies. That's for sure. At least not with uh, without the Mali one grip. Of course, there's a rabbit over there. That's a corrosive one. That is not good. Can we hit something? No. This might be a problem. Trying to melee damage anything? Nope. Yep. Yeah. <sighs> The corrosive ones. The <laughs> I only have a corrosive fastball, and I, I wanted to get like a, um, my bloodlust going. Like, a bloodbath actually, to kill him quickly with the grog nozzle. But for some reason, I I missed every fastball that I threw. The grog nozzle, drunk effect. We don't need to slag him. We have bloodlust, blood bath, <laughs> both. Now, salt the wound can also be a really good skill in combination with blood bath, especially if you have like a ravager or a Hulk, and a carnage. Um, but also like the interface or the conference call. A lot of overkill damage. And of course our fastball is wearing off a little bit in level. But it should still do a lot of work. <laughs> All the explosions in the screen. More slag. Well, 
we're getting close to 68. And with that closer and closer to 62. Uh, 72. <laughs> what am I saying? Pretty good blood explosion. No, a corrosive one. Let's get a kill skill quickly. I can't see anything. Oh my god, here we go again. Where are you? There you are. Even the ones that were corrosive uh, from that guy died to the blood explosion. Whoa, lots of small enemies. I'm not quite sure how well or how badly the peak is gonna go, but I do think like after like like level OP four or whatever, once you get like the double black queen and the double scorch and Dukina's mom, I might need to do some cheesy strats with the grog nozzle in the hive. But maybe not, who knows? As long as I can get kill skills with Bloodbath, I can kill lots of things pretty easily. Oh, and for the final boss we might need the Flacker. But we can farm that with Torque Tokens. Um, and we also want to get Torque Tokens anyways to get the Unkempt Herald with. And to farm Torque Tokens... With Bloodbath and a Topnia, it's really, really easy to do that on a Krieg. Especially in normal mode, but you could also do that in OP8. Like, I could actually do that for XP as well. But then I need a Topnia first. So that means we have to farm the Snowman to get a Fire Topnia. Oh, did I see a tubby? No. Don't think so, at least. But we are level 68. Nice. Okay, as I said earlier, we don't really use a lot of our shields, so let's do this kill skill. Chances of elemental effects. It helps with slagging them. I can set myself on fire, but only if I deal fire damage to enemies, which I currently am not. Uh, let's start the uh, Clan Wars mission. Yeah. In the dust. No, actually, it's in Sanctuary. Ooh, 
but already level 68, so uh, that's nice. We're gonna get that 72 pretty easily. Restoring the war. Hi, Charity. Slice your eyelids so you can watch the end. <laughs> well, that's not a very nice thing to say if someone calls you a cutie. Slicing their eyelids so they can watch what? I, I forgot. Alright, what is it? Oh yeah, I need to get the statues from the back here, right? Dayan. Oh, first the explosives. Alright. Check my junk, yard. As much as I'm sure you'd like to watch at least junk, we're not gonna do that. Who would want to kill a baby? I wouldn't. Any tubbies? Nope. Drunk effect. <laughs> That's a DPS. Some babbling a news, yeah. Apparently, the Irish have green blood. Haven't heard Jimbo that angry since the time he heard my family was leaving his dumbass clan. Mama didn't want to raise Scooter and me alongside a bunch of morons who'd sooner eat a baby than help raise one. Bad, and one time Jimbo told Boxy to kill some dude or they was gonna turn me into the clan wife. Moxie is, of course, Ellie's mom. I ain't got nothing to do with stalkers. Spirits bar. Let's go. Nice corrosive bandit gun. Steve. Nope, I didn't see him. Is that how you pour drinks? In this game, yes. Damn it. It's dry. Those hold destroyed my distillery. 
That's it. The truth is off. You, Hunter, let's that neck, though. Oh, I need to follow him. Oh, he trusts me very easily. <gasps> Wait, where's... Oh, he doesn't say hello anymore. Uh, hey, hey, yo. Oh, there we go. That's the plan. Starting the war. Now we're gonna go um, kill the Hodunks again. Because we actually want to farm the slag at this time, unlike our zero, where we wanted to actually kill Mech Zephyr, apparently. But my reasoning was well. If we kill the Hodunks, then the Zephyr should still be alive, and uh, we will be able to kill them. But <laughs> apparently, we did the Zephyrs a favor by killing the Hodunks, so the Zephyrs are now friendly and unattackable, and then the Hodunks were our enemies. That is what we're gonna do for this Krieg. Seeing as we have bloodlust anyway, a uh, bloodbath, blood explosion, whatever you wanna, <laughs> everything, we can kill uh, the Hodings in uh, one single grenade every time, right? Same with uh, mixed efforts, but or we'll just kill everyone with blood explosion. That can also happen. Go to the racetrack. The Hodunks do one of these races every so often. I want you to place them charges on the fireworks they leave around the track. When they set off the fireworks, it'll make for some proper violence. And we won't leave any. Uh, oh, shut up. We won't leave any witnesses. Why did I park the car over here? Oh well. <laughs> yes. These guys are so stupid. Like, I said the Zevers are stupid by not suspecting me of uh, destroying the distillery, but this guy literally sees me planting the explosives. Could try to destroy him with the detonation. Would I destroy my own car with that? Let's see. This time we're just gonna kill them with the fireworks. Or not. Maybe they'll, uh... Did that? <laughs> Wait. What? 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 I think my grub nozzle just killed that car in one shot. Not even the grenade. That's weird. Drunk effect! Maybe it was the grenade, who knows. In that case, it was a perfect timing. I don't see any tubbies. Nope.
Now, we need to go to the Hodungs. Will do. We gotta hit them in their money. Their, their wallets. <laughs> oh yeah, the voice lines from this guy. <laughs> what is that? Sure, let's get the cast cash stash. Somebody catch me! <laughs> Somebody catch me while I uh, jump in the air with the car. Sure. Seems like a proper idea. I'm just gonna drive over there to the bar. It's probably faster to fast travel in this case, but. It will save no more than 20 seconds. If at all. Hello. That's a sneeze. <laughs> that voice line. Oh man, it's so funny. I love this game. Now, at the time of the making of this video, it's actually um, March 13th, I believe, of 2019. Oh, March 14th, actually. And um, Borderlands 3 got officially teased by Randy Pitchford for uh, PAX East at March 28th. It could just be another... Uh, it could just be another fake tease. But everything points at uh, Borderlands 3 actually being released very time, very soon. This guy doesn't die very easily. Oh. Cut. Teleported using some Irish magic. I'm out of grenades. I might die. Where? Come on, where are you going, bro? Now you should be Ooh. scared. Paul says you can open all them cash boxes now that you got the Batman's key. Oh yeah, he drops those uh, weird ass grenades. Okay, I don't need to loot these chests. I don't need the money. Rubberized slag grenades, tedious. <laughs> rubberized you. Imagine having a rubberized explosive, uh, rubberized fastball grenade. That would suck. 
Also, for the first time in ages, I managed to run out of grenades on this guy. It doesn't happen very often. So we're gonna have to blow up all the trailers now, I think. And after that, we're gonna have to kill everything inside here. And then we do the... Uh, Actual clan war at the Lynchwood station. Oh yeah, we turned this in at uh, Steve. Hey, -oh. but now he's standing at this little intersection between these two areas. That was a perfect pathing right there. Yoink. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh, no. It's not to Steve yet. We have to go to the Hodunks first. Makes sense, actually, because they gave us the quest, right? I can't even do those voice lines these guys have. It's just gibberish. Is that the entrance? No. Nope. This is... Always check if there's tubbies when spider ants spawn and skags. <laughs> okay, say something. What? <laughs> Tedio grip? Nope. Hyperion grip? Nope. I, I wouldn't know what to do, honestly. Probably this one. Three ammo per shot, so it's still a two shot, right? Doesn't matter. We have to go to the bar again. Uh, you know what? Let's save quit this time. Oh. Hey oh. Aha. Uh -huh. I knew it. Let's burn that trailers to the ground. I won't do it at night though. Like, yeah, they can give me, like, a rocket launcher, but... We have the Uncamped Herald. Fire weapon. That's funny. Oh, okay. Flint Stinderbox. Oh, we also had the Logan's gun. That would take ages. Well, Flint's in the box it is. Stack the invincible. Uh, and we can turn it in again, so we save quit right at that exit. Perfect. This path thing is really good. So efficient. So cool. So, did we get the tinder box again? Oh, no, we finished this the mission, of course. Hey, -o. Vlad of Grip, both of them. 
Let's take the shock one. Why not? Okay, to the Hodunks. Now remember, we save quit, so any spider ants that spawn could be tubbies again. Ow, is that gonna kill me? It might. Didn't see tubbies. Imagine getting the carnage now, that would be great. Or another Tunguska, you know. Hello. Tell me another one of your stories. By a traitor, Moxie. Because she left the Hodunk family with uh, Ellie and Scooter. Hello, Moxie, give me some booze. I am strong stuff. <laughs> well, let's make them explode green. Because that's a recurring theme for these guys, apparently. I'm still walking in straight lines, I think. Come on, then. Go away. Take your time. Find a good spot to start shooting. Then kill them all. We are here today to just crash wake with bullets. I think we can just leave, right? Yeah. We don't need to kill him. Uh, return to Ellie. Well, we shouldn't be driving drunk now, should we? So that's fast travel. And that's the end of the Clan Wars quest, I believe. Now we have to find them at Lynchwood. What say we put an end to all this clan fight? Let's pick a side. Well, we're gonna kill the Hodunks. And we're gonna kill him a few times to get the Slagger. Now, how long has this been recording been going on? I'm very sorry, but need to check. Oh, okay, about 45 minutes. That's perfect. So we can uh, finish the whole quest in one video, and we reached 68 as well. So in 45 minutes, we did 66, 67 to 68, and the whole Clan Wars quest. Nice. Now you could save quit here and still kill the Zaffers after this, but now it's too late. 
we cannot kill the servers anymore, so we cannot get the Maggie from killing him. Nice family heirloom. It's uh, it's great. Oh, that's our slag uh, submachine gun. Now let's enter Lynchwood. And then we save quit uh, at the uh, exit. So we uh, can kill the Hodanks a few times. Do they spawn again? Right after leaving the quest? Yeah, they do. Oh, he didn't blood explode. It's two guys, right? The top one should explode. Hmm. Weird. And this is gonna be great XP as well. If I could hit something. There we go. Longbow shock transfusion. Now I want to get uh, at least one slag out of this video. Eventually, I do want to get a 99% legendary reaper as well. Preferably before we take on the peak. So I don't think we'll be staying here to farm for XP. Because we need to get back to the tubbies. Because 99 or 77, it still makes quite a big difference. Especially for the peak, right? I need all the bonuses I can get. And eventually, I want a perfect one anyways. And whether it's OP8 or 67 or something, it doesn't matter. Well, it would probably be 69 or something. I mean, obviously 69 is the best it, it can be. Period. For obvious reasons. <clears throat> Well, he missed <laughs> with that shotgun <laughs> from so close. Damn. He's got a higher new uh, marksman. Or rednecks. Can't really call them marksmen now, can we? Yeah, look at that. Like, the guy on top of him doesn't give a kill skill either. So that's why it doesn't explode. Oh no. Lots of blood explosions, but where's the slagger? None yet. Drunk effect, okay, that's really good. Uh, what? Um, why can't I hit these guys? Okay. I heard you like green. Then watch my screen. Man, I'm such a rapper. My god. I wasn't referencing to any 
substances. I was just referencing to the color of my screen with the green explosions. So whenever we do want to find the slagger, they don't drop it. Man, I just threw all my grenades. And we got six back. <laughs> or, wait, even more. Nine. Okay. Don't you just love Krieg? Well, we'll even reach 69 in this video. Probably. That sounded like a... Uh, Goliath. And this is why we need to slag up. I'm never sorry. Oh. All right. There we go. Just wanted some grenades. Now, for some reason, he hasn't dropped the slagger yet. Oh, dear. <laughs> Look at this guy shooting at the floor. I said I wanted to get a slagger. So we're gonna get it this video. I don't care. If I would have slagged him, oh, there we go. Man, these guys just so stingy with their drops. Wrong button. That moment when you press achievements feels bad. There we go. Level up. Still no slagger though. Man. Should we do this? Burn damage increased while you're on fire. Yeah, we can only let ourselves on fire with fire damage, so why not? <laughs> I just wanna get this lagger. This is turning out to be a long episode. Wait, did he die to damage over time? Hmm. Hey, a flacker. A casual flacker. We definitely want that to kill the uh, binary boss with. It's such a bit big hitbox. Oh dear. You walk the wrong 
Yo. Suddenly these guys can hit now. Well, at least we have a 250% increased uh, elemental effect chance whenever we get a kill. Unfortunately, we always want to select bef before we get a kill to get the kill. But seriously, where are the legendary drops? This is insane. At least we're getting good XP. That's gonna kill me. Well, it was 45 minutes long, but I expected us to get this lag a bit sooner than this. Ah, oh, this, yeah. Will that kill him as well? No, he ran away. Well, I said I wanted to end it when I got the slagger, and I will. Stop moving so much. <laughs> the blood splat. Can they even drop the slagger anymore? What the hell? No, 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 don't, don't do it. Yo, the slack chance on this uh, Uncamped Herald is... Uh, on the... Hey, there it is. Oh, wait a minute. I still need the Grog Nozzle for heals. So I'll do it like... This. Uh, Manamon Grip, that's really nice, that's all I wanted. Uh, increased snack chance. Nice. So I'll show you how fast we can slack now. It should be a lot faster. And it can also help us stack our bloodlust faster because we're shooting a lot more bullets. So let's take a look. But it's not necessarily faster. Oh wow! I'm, we immediately got another one. It's not necessarily faster, but it is definitely more consistent. Tedier grip. I don't know what the murdering prefix is, but aggressive. I don't know. Well, thank you very much for watching another episode. Um, we did quite a lot this video. 69 already. Lots of cool stuff that we found. And in the next one we might even reach level 72, but probably 70 or 71. So I'll see you in the next one. Thank you very much for watching and bye bye.